Um, my name is Bora Mai. I'm 22 years old now. Uh, I come from Cambodia. I'm a student and work at the same time. I have um, pain at my sponge, my back, lower back, which is uh, called scoliosis. Actually, I am um, having a tough time to find the hospital to do an operation. And when I arrived in Bangkok, I saw the video in YouTube, which is talking about the girl having operation of uh, scoliosis. And she has done in Victoria Hospital. So I was just like interesting. I book appointment online and then I check the hospital, the background and stuff. But after the consultant, the hospital, the doctor, the nurse and stuff um, bring me the positive side. So I decide immediately to do an operation in Whitney Hospital. She come to the hospital uh, with the back pain and her mother and she also uh, noticed that she have a deformity of the back since she was a teenager about uh, more than five years ago and, and the back pain is come off and on awfully. She can reduce her back pain with the medication and physical therapy but it's come back again. First of all we look at her uh, appearance and we found that she have a right shoulder elevation um, compared with the another side. She have a imbalance of the body so we send her to do the x-ray of the whole spine and we found that she have a scoliosis at the thoracic and lumbar spine. This is uh, the x-ray after we sent her to do the, the x-ray. This is uh, what we found. She have a quite a curve at the thoracic area about 40 degree and she also have a curve at lumbar spine about 40 degree also. So she was diagnosed as, as a idiopathic scoliosis. So the treatment that we suggest her to do is operation to correct the deformity. And the operation to be done is a posterior scoliotic correction under intraoperative neuro monitoring. And we done operation from T4 to L3. And this is the picture X-ray after the operation. We can correct the scoliosis more than 80% of the scoliotic correction. After the operation, she have a balance of the shoulder. She have a more stress of the spine from the thoracic. She also have left the curve of the lumbar spine, but in the future, the curve will be compensated and go be back to normal. Absolutely good. <laughs> yes, because everyone's so nice. They are taking care of me. Like they friendly, welcoming, and of course, hospital is so comfy and clean. That's the point. Clean. <laughs> the way they asking me, like they checking me up almost like every hour after the operation. And before the operation, they make sure that I'm completely fine. Like they check everything. I'm feeling fine, like just not that fine as normal, but good. Yeah. I actually recover more than I expect. Fast. Yes, faster than I expect. I, I can see the, the body, the physical, like so much better because I having a tough time to see myself not okay, you know, like like this. Like, yeah. Yes. But now I'm so happy every day when I wake up. Yes. After the surgery she stay in the hospital for five days. And after the day two of the surgery, we start her to do the rehabilitation. She can walk without the get it and now it's almost two weeks after the operation. The wound is healed nicely. She still has some wound pain, but it's less than before. And her back is more stretched. She can bend her back and she can do her normal activity daily living. Sure, sure. I, I recommend even I, I'm not having operation yet. Like, like everyone's so welcoming. Like yes, they're taking care of me. I, I so appreciate it. I thankful. I thank myself for finding out victory at, at the last minute because I actually have um research and study at uh, another hospital in Bangkok. So many, and at the end of the day, I decide to do it victory hospital. So <laughs> yes, I'm so thankful for myself. <laughs> Victory for life.
Leave us a comment below if you have any questions and please hit the subscribe button to stay updated with our healthcare videos.